Melissa, Teen Services Librarian at the Westmont Public Library, and today I will be showing you how to make a pony bead lizard keychain, like this one right here. So to get started, all you'll need is about four feet of some type of rope or string. This is plastic lacing. You will need a keychain ring, and then you will need your pony beads. You will need two black ones for the eyes, around 32 different colored ones for the body, and then about 16 uh, secondary colors for the belly and the feet. All right, so the first thing that you're gonna want to do is you're going to want to take your rope or string and tie it onto your keychain ring. So um, I have folded my uh, lacing in half, just like so, make sure it's even or almost even all the way down. And then you're just gonna take your keychain ring, place it on top of the uh, string or rope, and you're just gonna wanna pull the other end through. And so you kind of have a knot right there. Um, now a good tip is to get something heavy to hold down your keychain ring while you're making your lizard. So I just have a cookbook right here that I am just going to put it on so that way it doesn't kind of fall over the place. All right, so like I said before, you'll need three different colors uh, for your pony bead lizard. Two for the eyes, 32 for the body, and then uh, 16 secondary colors for the feet and the uh, belly. So what you're gonna wanna do first is you're gonna wanna take a primary color so color of the body, and you're just gonna wanna put it on the string like this. And then you are going to want to take the other half of your string and also put it in the bead the opposite side. So that way it looks like this. And you're gonna wanna pull it so it's all the way up. Just like so. And then for the next one, you are going to do two beads the same way. So one of the body color, another one, and then take your other piece of string, put it through, and pull. And then for the next step, we are going to add the eyes. And so you're going to put one black pony bead on one end of the string. You're going to do one color of the body and then another color for the eye. And you're going to do the same thing like the other two. Put the other half of the string through. And then pull. And then we are going to do another two of the body color. For the next part, we're going to do the feet. And so you're going to take one end of your string and you are going to put on two um, primary colors, the ones that match the lizard's body, and then you're going to want to do three of your secondary colors, so this will be your feet color. And then you, instead of putting the secondary string through it, you're going to take it and move it all the way up. And then you're going to take that same piece of string and thread it through the two primary colored ones. So you're going to leave the feet off to the side and you're going to take the two and you're just going to thread that through there, only doing between those two. And then you're going to hold it in place and take your string and pull it. So that way you have feet for your lizard, just like so. 
And now you're going to do the same thing on the opposite side where you're going to take two of the primary colors and three of the secondary colors. And then you're going to take your string and thread them only through the two primary colored ones. Hold them in place and pull. All right. And then next you're going to want to go back to the original way we were doing things and do two of the body colors. And then next we are going to do the colors of the belly as well. So you'll do one standard primary color, one of your secondary color, and then another one of your primary color. And it's the same thing where you put it on one string, put the other through all of them, and then you're going to pull. And then you're going to do that again, but you're going to add one more color to the belly. So it will be one primary color, two secondary color, and another primary color. Thread through the other side, and pull. Then we are going to go back to just doing the one. So one primary color, one secondary color, another primary, and then thread and pull. Then for the next row, you are going to do two of the primary colors again. And then we are going to do another pair of feet. So it's the same thing like we did before. You're going to do two of your primary colors, three of your secondary, and only put them on the one side. And then same thing on the other side again. to do another two of the primary color back to the original way. All right, and then now we're going to go to the tail. So you are going to take the remainder of your beads left and you are just gonna thread one at a time. So one through, through the other end and pull and you're just going to keep going like that. So as you can see, I have about six beads here for the tail. You can use as many or as little as you want for it. So now that we're done, what you want to do is you're going to take this and tie it at the end. So you'll take both of the strings together, wrap them around, and tie them through. And 
so that way it makes a knot at the end of your lizard. Just like that. All right, and then all you have to do now is cut off the excess. And there you have it, your own pony bead lizard keychain. Thank you guys so much for watching, and if you would like to see any more of our programming videos, please subscribe to our YouTube channel.